Hey guys, and welcome back. Today I'm going to be showing you my monthly spread for December, um, how I'm planning for Vlogmas, as well as the new weekly spreads that I'm doing. So let's just go ahead and get into it. So my monthly spreads look like this. I have adapted, adapted my month at a glance so that I have two lines for each day and they span anywhere from three, like this month did three, sometimes it does four, it kind of just depends. Well, three and a half pages. But I did red and green for my colors and then I have some snowflakes and these little Christmas tree washi that I got at Target. And then, so that it's kind of even, I always do a fourth page or half of my third page, which has a goals. And I have three goals for this month. One that is um, a, like a work goal, a house and family goal, and then a personal goal. And then I also have an upcoming, so stuff that's going to come up next month, or in this case, you know, like next year. And then we have some of my Vlogmas notes. So my Vlogmas notes are kind of just everywhere. This is sort of just a running to-do, so I have stuff I need to film, stuff I need to edit. And then if you go back before November, I have this here to mark my page, but I just have some alternate ideas. There's just notes here that Aria got a hold of. There's kind of just Vlogmas stuff all over the place. But for this month, this is where I'm keeping the majority of it. And I just have this cute little stocking. The stocking fell off. but And then I have this room down here for any additional notes that I come up with. Um, and this is my new weekly spread. It's kind of like the spread that Boho Berry is doing. And then I've seen it around a little bit. And I've adapted it to what I need. So on the first page, I have, just like Boho Berry, I have the time-sensitive tasks or appointments and then just things I need to have done on a certain day, but it doesn't really matter when, I'm just kind of something that I'm doing. And then on the next page, I have a running to-do, which this is really just my condensed, Mom. I actually have like a full Mom. Like, list. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Can you throw that away? And then I have my Vlogmas tracker so that I know that I uploaded a video for whatever day it is. And then once the box gets filled in, that means that I have a video uploaded. And then if I plan on having a video uploaded on a certain date, I can just write it and color it in when it's done. And then I have my goals on this side, which I haven't finished for the week. But these are pretty much just like my weekly goals. So I have a family, personal, or family, professional, and a personal goal for every week. And then, or they're also tasks and projects. Like if any of my to-dos like fit in here, I can just move them over. But I'm kind of trying to keep this mostly just for goals or big projects. And then, and then And then at the bottom of the page, I just have my top three. So it's one goal from each of the categories, which this is pretty much just like how Boho Berry was doing it. And I thought I would give it a try. So if you've seen my previous videos, you know that I did my weekly spreads a whole lot more casual than this. But I also got out of doing daily or weekly planning at all. So I'm going to try something new to get me into it. And her idea seemed seem like it might work for me because it's still pretty casual but it's also kind of structured so we'll see how it goes but that is just how I am going on for December right now I'll be sure to keep you guys updated don't forget to subscribe to see more of my planning videos and also vlogmas which I'm doing I'm pretty successful I have seven days done so far good job to me and let me know if you guys what kind of weekly spread you guys are doing down below because i am looking for a better weekly spread i'll see you guys next time bye